Okay. Oh, you're right, you're right. Hi guys, so we're back with... We've now arrived at a strange location, so I'm just going to tell you. Uh, you got to prepare for that, because if you thought you were that interesting, you're not anymore. Trainers that don't have any place to train. Look, there's a perfect tennis court right here. Mm-hmm. You know, but if you said a long line's gonna help you, I don't see it. I'll tell you what this dog wants though. He doesn't like to get up on that platform. Something like this is help him. Try to encourage them to do something they want, don't want to do. It's going to happen. You're always going to remember that. You're always going to remember this. This looks dangerous for little kids. <laughs> Doesn't it? My God. Yeah, he wants that. There he goes. <laughs> Yay. Yay. Yeah, this guy over here looks like a real creeper. All right, we'll just walk towards it because that's what's going to happen. This is what this dog's problem was. Stranger danger is probably because it. Stranger danger, stranger danger. Hmm? And he may be right in this one. All right, so same thing. Yep. That's why I want you to realize that, you know, that your recall and the coming to you isn't that different. This dog is, though, you just said, well, this seems 
similar to the scene at the house. I said, you know, it does, because look at it. He's already got the bent paw and everything. <laughs> You know, and I'm not sure that's not something we're just going to start teaching all of them. Because if you just sit down and your dog just lays down beside you, well, isn't that what people want? Mm -hmm. They want to be able to go to an outdoor restaurant. And bring their dog. And have the dog <laughs> under the table with a perfectly well behaved yes, pet. Yes, yes. That can get all kinds of compliments. So, again, he's kind of hinky about getting the collar on, too. So I'm trying to be, but my hands are greasy from the hot dog, so I'm not doing a good job. Again, but you're, you're, you know, he's got the faith that I'm not going to jerk that leash. I mean, he, I, he wouldn't have any reason to think I would do that. I've never done that. Oh, you precious, precious boy. So, you remember, you guys, yesterday we were working on the bent paw. So, somehow, you know, and if things are a coincidence and you don't reinforce them, well, they probably do go away. All right, so. Duke, there's my page up there. I was making it do a dirt. Yeah. I'm not going to ask for the vent paw every time. But you can see how my leash is, though, and I'm, I'm maintaining that. You know, and if I said, well, I'll use this line for my gauge, this green line, that's a good idea. Yeah. I bent him with the page right there. Yeah. So see, I just made it into a turn toy. thinking, yay. I'm going to tell you why I rewarded him, because he moved the back foot. Yeah, and, you know, just generalize. If you said to yourself, I was like a hokey pokey, you move your left foot in your, you would try various things, you know what I mean? What's the hokey pokey? Uh, your left foot in, your right foot in, you know what I mean? Is it a, oh, Crystal knows it well. <laughs> and then, you know, now she doesn't realize that's what now the camera's going, when you guys see the camera go like this, that's her doing the hokey pokey. <laughs> I want you to look how closely he looks at my kid. He moved his feet right there. Let me try it. Yeah. Yeah. I forget about the right now, but you know, if we took the, you know, and again, now if you said, well, what's the difference now? He's not saying to himself, you know, and that's why you don't want, you know, again, I'm not going to have a physical, if you think that that's a reward, honestly, don't know anything about dog, and, and it ends up being a demarcation, is what it is, it marks something, they're not sure what. You know, if I want him to move the Duke. If you said, what, is, what has he got? I mean, he sort of developed, and I'm gonna wait. Yeah. I'm gonna, I got. Yeah. yeah. I want him to go on the hip. Sometimes you may have to just give in. If I said, well, I'm gonna make him do. Honestly, it would be worse. He's not going to remember that he didn't go on the hip because I've got time, and that's what you guys have to have. That's what you've got to have. You can learn a little bit, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit, but I mean, it takes time. 
So yeah, Fred, he's working out great as a companion, but we've got to get him around more distractions once he gets a little bit farther along, because he's definitely got, you know, that tendency, Chris has seen it, where, you know, if it's something new or something like a new mm -hmm. dog, well, I'll tell you, he doesn't give him a warm welcome, does he? No, no. All right, we'll be right back.